Hey guys, Mike Miner here. Another cool stuff today on uh, GPU mining. Today we'll be discussing about dual mining on HiveOS. What coin are we going to mine? So of course, we will be mining uh, Ethereum and Zilliqa. So we're gonna run it in HiveOS. We can earn extra uh, coins within a span of a uh, few hours, few minutes. So normally when Zilliqa is running, it actually run in between uh, 60 to 90 minutes. So let's say, for example, we are running on Ethereum right now. And then, and then uh, Zilliqa will run in about, let's say, after an hour. So it will run after an hour, then but it will only run for a few minutes or a few seconds. Then it will try to, to to mine some coins. After that, it will shift back to Ethereum, and then we can still continue mining. So basically, the algorithm there on Zilliqa is still the same with Ethereum. It doesn't get reset. So whatever DAG file that we have generated, it will not be reset. So, so that's that's how these uh, two things work. So the next step that we're gonna do is we're gonna create a wallet in HiveOS. We're gonna create a wallet. It's very simple. Let's try to go to my farm. Currently, I have uh, nine workers and I got uh, fifty GPU running at about uh, four point eight kilowatt and 1.3 giga hash later i will explain why i lower it down my giga hash so now we're going to create a wallet go to wallets and then uh, click here add wallet and then we'll just have to select eth and we need to prepare we need to prepare our our wallet coming from any any uh wallets that we have let's say on uh, an exchange wallet so first is we're gonna put here our ethereum wallet then it's followed by uh dot then our zilliqa wallet so we must make sure that there's no space in between here So we remove and then put it back. So no space. Uh, actually, there's space. Uh, so we must make sure. Okay. And so once we have key in our address here, we key in our name for this kind of wallet. So I name it as uh, for testing test uh, wallet Ethereum and Zilliqa. And then I uh, just have to name it as uh, the source is actually, we don't have any source. So just have to name it as this wallet, Ethereum or ETH and Zill and then create. And then the next step is we're going to create a flight sheet. So creating a flight sheet is still the same. We're going to go to HiveOS. And then we go to flight sheets and then we key in our coin here. We just have to select ETH and the wallet that we have created. We select test ETH ZIL and the pool, it's under EZIL. So select that one and we need to take this SSL URLs. Since I'm in Asia, so I select Asia. And then you can select other pool server like for your fallback let's say the asia is down then you may may try to use usa usa west Euro, europe and uh china then apply then you get to select uh currently i'm using g minor so it's quite stable for me I'm using nvidia and uh under amd so even though it's a mixed rig it will still work so I named this flight sheet as test flight sheet 
uh, if and zeal and then create flight sheet another thing that we need to set that i forgotten to mention is under your flight sheet you must configure your g minor g minor and then try to add extra config arguments the parameter which is uh, dash dash cash underscore dag space then one and apply the changes so next step is we're gonna assign it to the rig assign to the rig the flight sheet that we have created and we go back to our flight sheet here or our hive os farm and we try to select a rig let's say for example i'm going to show you my mix rig rig 03 so we can assign we just go to flight sheet here and we select the test if e wallet and then we press this one as our flight sheet so currently i already have an existing uh, flight sheet which is running on easel and it's already running like this in order for us to verify if uh, our rig is really mining easel and uh, and if we can go to easel.me to view the status of your rigs so i'm gonna show you my rigs right now i have uh so once you go to the easel you need to fill in your wallet so later on it will prompt you also your wallet your it and your zeal so in order for you to see the status of your rigs so currently i have uh when i try to check my workers i'm running already eight here so it's running eight rigs and uh i got the ninth rig which is running on uh ergo the ergo i will be discussing later on it will be another topic because ergo and uh silica they're different there are different types of algorithm but i'm still doing the mining so i can be able still to mine so I will share that one on another episode because that rig is running on 4GB cards and uh, and it's running also uh, Ergo. So now I'm running here the Ethereum and Zilliqa. All of these rigs are running for those algorithms. And uh, profitability, I can share a bit. So I got a daily profit of... Uh, 0 0.043559 per day and i got 43 zilica per day with a total of 89 dollars per day 0.16 as of uh, july 28 uh, june 28 sorry june 28 2021 and uh, so yeah this is the average currently it's a bit high because uh, ethereum is pumping up so it's a good sign, a good news for all of us. And uh, 1299 Zilliqa per month. So that's a total of 2674.68 per month. And now I can share maybe uh, when did I start mining. So I started ready way back uh, June 20th. So it's more than a week now. So far so good. The profit here it's almost same with uh last time was mining with hyvon profitability is almost the same and but i got extra coin profit daily with Z, uh, with zilica so so far so good because the minimum payout for for both of the coins are is 0 0.05 and 30 zil per day so not usually this one is 0 0.1 so if it's 0 0.1 you can still adjust this to another number that you're comfortable with to for your payout so mine is 0 0.05 and 30 so 
an average of two days i can get my payout on 0 0.05 but if the traffic is quite high within a day i can get ready my 0 0.05 so Thanks for watching, guys. This is another episode of Mike Miner. I hope you, you learned something on uh, dual mining on Ethereum and Zilliqa. Goodbye.